City Council President Katherine Davidson invited the mayor of Alexandria to a special council meeting to discuss the shortage of policing. She tells us that she doesn't want an investigation. She just wants the city safe. She tells us why it's important to find a solution to crime. On Sunday night, eight blocks from my house, a young girl was shot and killed. Um, on Elliott Street, um, a woman was sexually assaulted at noon, a 70-year-old woman, two blocks from my house. Um, a couple of weeks ago, there were fights on Harvard Street, Harvard Street that drove down Hill Street shooting up cars that are five blocks from my house. It needs to be addressed, and the most simple way to address it initially is to fix your coverage issue. Um, more policing coverage is a deterrent. It really is just that simple. Davidson called the meeting to ask the mayor and his administration for an action plan on how to fix the police shortages. She also wants documentation to prove the zones are covered. She begs the public to ask for help from the Rapids Sheriff's Office until vacancies are filled. They're so short that we have special teams that aren't able to do the specialized policing, proactive policing, because we don't have enough patrols. And, and fixing that, um, I think, will go a long way to um, the crime reduction. Councilwoman Cynthia Perry works for the Rapids Parish School System. She knows firsthand the pain of students getting killed. The city council empathized with her as they discuss how to proceed. It hurts me because the majority of the ones that are being killed are students that attend the school that I will get. Uh, it's saddening to me. All this goes away if, if the administration will just merely get in, in touch with the with the sheriff uh, and see if we can work out some type of a situation where we can use off-duty sheriff's officers or whatever. One citizen does not believe more policing is the right solution. Milton believes the community itself needs to make a change. We have got to take back our neighborhoods. Nothing is more powerful than when people learn how to empower themselves. That's where it has to start. Katherine Davidson says the mayor's administration should implement a police officer recruiting plan to fix the shortages. She hopes they can work together to decrease the crime rate. Keisha Swafford, ABC 31 News, that works for you.